Pepe should have done Saturday, it's your 200th game for the club. Just how proud of moment would that be if you get to that number? No, yes, yeah, it's great to play 200 clubs for anyone. So uh, for me to get to Luton after a couple of injury seasons that I had, it's great to have a uh, 200 games and listen, hopefully there's many more, but got to focus on game first and after. I can celebrate the win and 200 games as well. Mm. As I say, at, at the start, I mean, you, you did have a your, few injuries in the first couple of seasons, so just getting there is a, a massive achievement, isn't it? Yeah, 100%, yeah. Yeah, yeah everyone knows uh, I was playing and then got injured, had a lot of hammies, and then, uh, well, I'll go over it. Well, Jared, who's gone to Stoke with the gaffer, for my gaffer, Jennifer Jones, got me fit, got me fighting there. Uh, and now I'm playing nine minutes every every um, every game every season, and uh, it's been a it's been a good uh, turnaround for me. Were well, those quite tough mentally at the time when when, it, when you obviously the body wasn't working as you wanted to, and you couldn't you couldn't play as much as, as you wanted to play as well? Yeah, it was definitely hard. Um, yeah, everyone wants to play every minute, so it was more mentally have the family around, friends around to keep me going, and yeah, thankfully it worked. And now I'm playing, it's it's, it's good, but it was it was tough at the moment. Yeah. Do you think Nathan, Nathan and Jared they're big? Big factors as to how that sort of turnaround. Yeah, 100. percent Yeah, obviously John Steele was an old school manager. Run this, run that. But Jared and the other, he's, they've they put put sports science into it. They've managed managed me how I train, how I play, how I, in the gym and that. So for me, I got to thank them for help. And uh, obviously Luke and L have continued it, and it's been it's been great for me. Look at this season. I think you've missed just 15 minutes in the league. I mean, yeah. that must be disappointing to have missed that miss that little period. Yeah, I can't lie. I thought I was playing well in that game as well. So I was like, oh, I'm not coming off. I thought it was, I was, I was shins at 11. That nice, 70. So uh, yeah, at least I'm playing every every game. It's, it's good to get well it's a little rest. But yeah, I've got to continue the season in lower yet. So we've got a couple more games, and hopefully we can get up. When you look back when you when you joined, I think it's a long time ago now. Just just how much have things changed? Obviously, training is different in the clubs in a much different place. Isn't it? Yeah, when I came, we had the Ilo Ilo Iliway, Porter cabins, pitch went great. For sit, well, the gym was there, or one rack for twenty people. So listen, we've got a new training ground here, a lot more staff, a lot more better facilities. Training pitch is much better. So really, it's been a it's been a mighty change, and obviously the stadium. All planning permission, hopefully it goes through and uh, yes, it's the club is on the rise. Mm. Those days back in the conference, I mean, it was diff just different, wasn't it? Playing those kind of teams and I mean, obviously the team did fantastic to get out of that, that other league when you were there as well, didn't they? Yeah, I think conference is one of the hardest leagues to won and everyone else got a chase. Well, when I came, it was behind Cambridge, so we made a great run and we got promoted and it was, it was a great feeling and everyone was, was happy. It was a good time for the club. And two, look, two promotions on your CV now at the same club, I mean, not yeah. many people can say that, can't they? Nah, I think I'm the, I'm the only one that's remaining, so it's, it's frankly, I'm still here. I thought I'd be gone by then, well, by now. But yeah, it's, it's great that the clubs believed in me and I've, hopefully I can repay the faith. What's some of the best memories as well since, since you've been here? Oof, there's, there's, there's a lot. Uh, obviously, the conference. To be honest, it's all the promotions. Uh, it's great to get a promotion, but with two and then hopefully three. So I'm possibly mainly do the promotions. And this season as well, it's just been fantastic. I mean, no defeat since October. Yeah. I mean, could, could you expect it to go as well as this? Uh, can't lie, it's a tough start. We played Peterborough, we played Sunderland, we played Portsmouth. It's a tough run, and we thought, ah, oh, here we go. But since October, we've, we've stepped it up. We ain't lost. We're flying five points ahead of Barnsley, and everyone's got to catch us. So we've we've put a great run, and obviously everyone say don't look at results, but. We want Sunderland and Barnsley to slip up, so it makes it easier for us, if I'm being honest. But got to focus on on winning and well, the next game, Bristol Rovers away. When you could last week, so that, that was a fantastic performance, wasn't it, against Doncaster? Yeah. I mean, obviously, yourself and the target as well. Must must be pleased with with that finish. Yeah, I was playing DMF. We don't really get a lot of chances. Me, Mac, or Glenn, or Georgie, who's going to play there? So, Kaz run with the ball and I put him put it bottom corner. People try to say it's a free ball, but. Uh, the hate is the hate is the hate is. But uh, yeah, it was good to get a score sheet and help my team obviously keep a clean sheet and uh, well, score four goals. It was a great, great game. Most of your goals are quite powerful efforts. It yeah. was just side fit, just composed with this one. Yeah, it was a close finish. Everyone say that I had to beat it, blazing squad and that, but nah, I rolled it in and frankly went in. Got the, bo got the boys on the, on the roll. And so good to play with someone like Kazenga as well. I mean, he's, he's just set, set himself for that game, scored mm. as well, and he's got a lot of assists and crowd favourite, isn't he? Yeah, his crowd favourite. He's, he's, he's got the tricks, he's got the, he's, he's got the skills, and yeah, Linka plays great, so everyone likes playing with him. Obviously, all our strikers are playing well. Colo, Hiltz, you might be sitting out. Cornick, everyone who plays up there is, is doing a great job, so can't really complain. And also, Jace is coming from, from Alonia, he's 
add a little bit of gall, so it's, it's great to play with all of them. Mm. Nice if James comes back as well, obviously, didn't, didn't get the capital on the Friday, and yeah. it's going to come back fresh, isn't it? Yeah, I'm playing, uh, obviously I was watching the game, trying to help Colo get on, but it's an experience there to play for Ireland, and uh, yeah, he's come back fresh, hopefully we've well, done well without him, don't even get back in the team, but it's all mad, but yeah, he's going to come back, fight for his place, and hopefully if he plays, whoever plays, goes on Saturday and makes it a lot more easier for us at the back and me holding that we a chilled game and a lot of goals goes in for us. Just to have his mean they've not done so well at home this season, but it is, mm. it is a chance to go and, and get another another unbeaten game, another victory, isn't it? Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, we've got to focus on like Bristol Rovers, like any other game, it's going to be difficult. We've got to go there, match them, pace of pace, second balls, everything, and hopefully our quality comes through and uh, we get the victory we need. And if you can't stand beating, that's a club record, 27 games, which mm -hmm. you were part of the team to set that yeah. conference. So it's quite, I mean, it'd be great to do, it's quite unusual to be the, in, in the team, a player does that twice, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's not really happen. This is, I don't know, once a lifetime, but it's, it's, it's a great achievement for me, for the club, and hopefully we can achieve that. We've got to get into the mindset that it's, 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 it's just, just another game, and hopefully we can can come out with a, with a W. You look at the squad as well, I mean Collins, Justin and Stacey in the, the team of the year now. Yeah. Just how good is that for the squad to have three, three players in there and, and could have been more easy. Yeah, it's great, yeah. Jack and JJ have been great all season, Collins are banging the goal so we can't really complain. Uh, Shades have been great even though he's He's done. He hasn't done anything. It's been Matty and it's been Matty and Sonny helping him out and uh, obviously there could have been more of us. I thought Shins deserved a place in there. And uh, yeah, it's, 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 it's one of them but everyone knows that we're where we're, we're a great team and uh, at, right now no one can stop us. The goal of the season, I think you're in the, the final five now for, for that one as well, so yeah. it must be nice for yourself to, to be up for that award. Yeah, uh, any award is nice award, so it's, it's always a team game, but yeah, that striker was, was nice and well, yeah, hopefully people have been voting for me, so yeah, so hopefully yeah, yeah, another award would be, would be great. As you mentioned, Beth Sunderland and Portsmouth not playing this weekend now, I mean, it's a, if you can go there and win, mm -hmm. put 13 points then, which would be a real boost at this age of the season, wouldn't it? Yeah, 100 percent yeah. We've got, we've got to take the win. If they're not playing, then they're going to think, oh, well, look how many points we're behind. It's a lot of pressure. So the more we put pressure on them, the more they're going to think, oh, we need to win, we need to win. And hopefully they, they crumble, they, they fall away. And it makes it easier for us the last couple of games that even if we're up, we can not take the foot off the pedal. But it's, 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 it's nice knowing that you've, you've, done, a, you've done a job and uh, we're up.